These are basically my best trousers and they've still got oil all over them. I got my first car when I was 19. It was destroyed, basically. The biggest hurdle for people is not having this basic level of knowledge on mechanical engineering. The air flowing in all the way around the system and into the cylinder head. This is the way to get started learning about cars. If you don't have somebody who's going to guide you through, this is the next best thing. Now, running one of these belts around, always a bit of a wrestling match. These are exciting! When you look at professional garages, yeah, I, I almost used to feel like they had a huge library in the back. You know, how do these guys know how to fix all these different cars that come in there? Well, the answer to that, and it's no secret, is that they understand how cars work, and that's what this course sets out to do. Beep, beep! This is the whole cooling system for our car. Let me wrestle this wiring loom on here and find a relay. The best way to learn about cars is to take one to pieces and put it back together again. And what's great about this car is that we can split it into two parts. Woo! We're on fire. We start with a complete MX-5 Miata. We strip it down to the chassis and then we rebuild the whole car from its components, explaining everything as we go. From a teaching point of view, this car is perfect. It's got everything that you need to know and nothing that you don't. And by the time we get to the end of this course, you're gonna be able to look under the hood here and you'll know exactly what everything is, what it does, and how it works together. Today, a real treat. The starter motor, the water pump, the flywheel, inlet manifold, engine mounts, MAF sensor. We go into mad amounts of detail on just the smallest parts of a car. We shoot everything in 4K, professional sound, professional lighting. Pro Look at this. Pro kit. Or oh, maybe I've messed up the whole lighting. Sorry, guys. I'm Alex Muir, and this is How a Car Works. 